Hey folks, Mark Joyner here. In the next few minutes, allow me to demonstrate for you some of the new features that we just added to the Simpleology browser add-on for Chrome version 1.26. Now, the last feature I want to show you, I think is probably the most significant feature we've added, maybe yet. So before I show you those, allow me to reassure you that the new version still does all of the old things that the original version did. For example, you can save the page that you're on to the Dreamcatcher, and you can highlight text and then save that text to the Dreamcatcher. And you can also go up here to the Omni bar, and you can type in DC space, and then type in uh, any text that you like. And as you can see here, that is now added to your Dreamcatcher. And you could do this from anywhere on the web. So what's new? Well, the first most significant feature that we've added is something that we used to have in the early version of this uh, tool uh, many years ago now, uh, called the browser bodyguard. Now you can run this in two different modes. The first is called uh, block sites mode and you can edit this. And by the way, you can create as many of these different profiles as you like with all of these different settings. So block sites is going to allow you to block uh, all sites except for the ones that you outline or only the specific sites that you outline. So once you have your profile set up, all you have to do is enable the particular profile that you're going to work with and then hit save. So let's see what happens. We're going to go to a new tab here and I'm going to type in youtube.com. And as you can see here, instead of going to YouTube, we've been directed to our list of daily targets. You can run this also in uh, disrupt surfing mode. Now what disrupt surfing mode does is instead of redirecting you to a new URL, it sends you a disrupting notice. So we're going to go in here and we're going to save that we're in surf disrupting mode and then we're going to go try to go to a blocked site. Now instead of blocking it, as you can see here, we get this little notice saying, hey, focus on your daily targets. Now you can set this sound to whatever you want and disable it. And you can also allow yourself to continue surfing for a few more minutes if you're doing something serious or if you want to give yourself a break. Now those two features alone are probably going to have a very, very significant boost on your productivity if you actually enable the add-on and use it. But the third feature is even better than that. Now this is one that's only available to uh, pro account holders or higher and it is called uh, Focus Enforcer. And you have a tick box here, it's very, very simple. And it says display my current target via a browser bar. And then as you can see here, you have an option to flash that very lightly every however many minutes you want. Now we'll set it for one and we'll see if that comes up by the time that we're done talking. So we have that saved now, and now we're gonna go to a new tab. And as you can see here, the current target that you are working on is always going to be displayed at the top of your browser. So no matter where you are, no matter what you're doing, you're always going to have this constant reminder. And as you'll see here, uh, after a, a minute passes, this is going to flash a little bit. Now again, you can set that uh, flashing to happen every one minute, every 10 minutes, every 60 minutes, whatever you choose. Um, the idea here is if you have not blocked uh, sites that did end up becoming distracting. Um, and this often happens as we're uh, doing legitimate research. We click on some uh, shiny link and it takes us somewhere where we don't want to be. Well, this is going to pull us out of that trance and bring us back to the job of getting really, really important stuff done. And that's it. So uh, I encourage you to download this and uh, install it and play with it. And uh, I'd love to hear your feedback on how this is boosting your productivity. As you can see there, it just flashed for us a little bit to give us a, a little reminder to get back to work. All right, enjoy. Oh, and I forgot to add, of course, if you click that you're done with this target, your next one pops right up.